Hey guys, Mark McKillier here with liveanabolic.com and guess what? I have an eight minute at home cardio workout for all you beginners out there. All right, guys, cardio is really important. Now, I don't want you going out and trying to do an hour or two hours of cardio. Some of these crazy guys get on these bicycles and go for hours and hours at a time, whether it's outside on the road or inside on a stationary bike. Same thing, same thing for you guys that like to jog, okay, or get on the treadmill. You know, more is not always better because when you do long bouts of cardio, you put a lot of stress on your body for a long period of time. And the problem with that is because we're older, it can actually increase the stress levels on our body. And guess what that does? It increases a hormone called cortisol. Now, the more cortisol your body produces, the less testosterone your body can produce. And because, you know, we're over 40 guys, I'm 57, we're not producing nearly as much testosterone as we did when we were in our 20s and 30s. So, that's why I really like doing short bouts of cardio. It's fantastic for your heart, for your lungs, for your muscular capacity, but it doesn't increase our cortisol levels and therefore it doesn't hurt our testosterone production, okay? So, follow along, I'm gonna do an eight minute workout for you guys. It's real straightforward, especially for you beginners, okay? I'm gonna start off with doing some jump squats. Now, guys, I'm gonna show you how to do each exercise, okay? So I'm gonna show you the correct form. Now, so we're starting standing up. So after the jump squats, we're gonna get out on the ground and we're gonna do something called a reverse plank thrust, all right? And then you're gonna notice, I'll make you stand back up again, all right? So we're stand back up, we're gonna be doing some butt kicks. And then after that exercise, get back down on the floor and we finish up with something called an air bike crunch. All right, guys, follow along, it's real straightforward. And if you're a beginner in these these uh, uh, squat jumps are too tough for you. Let me show you a different way. Okay, so a squat jump is this. You just go down and then literally you just jump up, all right? So if you can't go all the way down, you can't jump all the way up, but that hurts your knees or your back, okay? I'm just fine with this, okay? So what we're gonna do today is every exercise is gonna be done for 30 seconds, all right? So just kind of follow along. And I would, I'm going to do much higher. All right, that's about 30 seconds. So now what I want you to do, because this is a beginner cardio workout plan, I want you to give yourself 30 seconds of rest. All right, once you get further along, get in better shape, you're gonna notice a lot of my cardio workouts have you doing the exercises back to back with no rest in between. So, guys, 30 seconds should be enough rest. Get down the ground here. I'm gonna show you how to do something called reverse plank thrust. Now, once again, I'm just gonna do this for about 30 seconds, and then afterwards, rest for 30 seconds. So here we go. Out this way and just bring your hips straight up to the air. <laughs> so you're gonna feel this in your hamstrings and your glutes, guys. And of course, this works your entire core. Okay, whew, guys, you might have a big clock or use the stopwatch maybe on your smartphone. I'm just kind of guessing at 30 seconds here. All right, get your breath. Now guess what? I'm gonna make you stand back up. So we're going up, down, up, down. Fourth exercise, real straightforward, it's called butt kicks. And once again, guys, you're a beginner and your knees are bad, your hips or your ankles or something like that, that's fine. I'm gonna show you how to do them without hurting your joints. So here we go. All right, butt kicks, just like the name sounds, I want you to try to jog in place and kick your heels up 
until they hit your butt. You only need to do this for 30 seconds. So guys, if you can't do that, okay, if that's too hard, I'm fine with just going back and forth like a walking butt kick, okay? This is the jogging butt kick. Bouncing up and down on my toes. Can't do that. Slow it down. Okay. So 30 seconds. Stop. Give yourself 30 seconds rest. We're gonna get back down the ground. We're gonna finish up with our last exercise. So guys, 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off. Each exercise therefore takes one minute. I have four exercises, four minutes to do one circuit, okay? Into the circuit, you're not done. I want you to do one more circuit. Total of two circuits, eight minutes, you're done. You're gonna really feel your heart rate get up. You'll be out of breath. And guys, I guarantee you're gonna burn some good calories here. So air bike crunches here, just 30 seconds. All right, that feels like 30 seconds to me. Whew. Now guys, now if you're a beginner and you're totally gassed right now, I get it, okay? Give yourself a couple minutes to catch your breath and do this circuit all over again, all right? If you're in better shape, just rest 30 seconds, stand back up and do those jump squats, all right? Just get back into it. So guys, I want you to take the same mental attitude that I have, and that is, I'm not gonna use age as an excuse. I want to continue to live, just like I did 20, 30 years ago. And you can, trust me guys, I'm 57 years old, and I can still hang with a bunch of my friends that are in their 20s. I can hit the gym with them, I can go running with them, I can climb mountains with them, I can do pretty much anything those guys can do. And I want you to have that same mental attitude, okay? It is not too late, but you gotta know what to do. All right? And then after you know what to do, you need to follow through. You need to take action. So the first step, guys, click the link below this video. It's going to take you over to a fantastic program that I personally designed. It's called Fit After 50. It's a comprehensive three-phase program designed specifically for guys our age. All right? And it's going to step you through that long journey. Okay? It's not going to happen overnight. But you have to do something. you got to take that first step. But take it with me, guys. I promise you, you're going to love this program.